that's not acceptable and welfare groups, church groups and many progressive um, uh, non-government organisations have come out against this and the Greens are opposed to it. The income management is a program that we've already seen play out in the Northern Territory in a way that is deeply destructive. What it means is the people in Bankstown, if they're receiving benefits, that they could be included in this government trial where they would have a large part of their benefits literally taken off them and the government would decide how that money is spent. Now we've already had complaints from some small business people concerned that they will be losing business because it's the big retailers like Woolworths who um, go into an arrangement with the federal government so people can use their card there. Our main concern today is the impact it has on ordinary people. Ordinary people who are trying to organise their life, they've got a right to get benefits from the government and they have a right to decide how to use that. We recognise that where we are at at the moment it's very important that we raise awareness about this program and that we then work very strongly and clearly with a whole range of organisations to send a message to the government that come next year, when it gets to July 1, we do not want this trial starting in Bankstown. It will bring more hardship, more victimisation, and that people shouldn't be vilified in that way. Understandably, people ask the Greens, well, what, what's the government up to? You work with the government, what's their tactics? On this issue, we certainly do not work with the government. We have voted against this program whenever it has come before the federal government. But as we know, Labor and the Coalition have worked closely on this issue since it was introduced into the Northern Territory. One reason that some people have suggested that the government might be taking this trial into areas like Bankstown and other areas around the country, so it's not just in the Northern Territory, is so they no longer, that so no longer could the government be accused of mounting a racist program. Because let's remember when the income management was first introduced into the Northern Territory, the federal government had to suspend the Racial Discrimination Act because they were clearly discriminating against Aboriginal people. Whatever the reasons are, the Greens will continue to oppose it, work very closely with community groups to raise awareness and to particularly raise a strong voice that under no circumstances should we have income management in Bankstown.